artist wanting to sculpt something, you wouldn't just take a big clump of clay and splat it down on the table and then say, ah, oh, that didn't turn out the way I wanted it. Like that splat should have been enough. You want to get your hands in it and mold it and evaluate it and, and watch it become closer and closer to the vortex version of what you have defined that you want. You're doing very well. Just keep having fun with it. Let's see another video. Thank you, Abraham, for answering my question about my mother who transitioned the day before you answered. And it was, as you said, it would be, it was resistant free and full of love. For 30 seconds, I saw a beautiful look of bliss and wow on her face and thought of Steve Jobs and how he said wow. And I felt my father and her receiving him. It was just magnificent. And now I have so much peace. My desire now is to continue to feel her and dance with her and my other guides as well, including my father. Any advice you can give me because I really want to hear and feel them in on my project and have more fun with their wisdom. Thank you so much, much love, and um, anything you can say about that transition and what I saw would also give me great love. We like that you had an actual visceral feeling experience where you, for a moment, got to feel what the absence of resistance feels like. And that's your goal, to feel good. Don't try to think your way into cooperative interaction with them. Just know that they always feel good. And if that's your dominant intent, more or even all of the time, you have so many interactions with them. That really is simple, isn't it? Yeah. It really is simple. What makes them say, wow, is how simple it is. How easy it is in a non-resistant realm to feel no resistance. And an instantaneous recognition of the perfection of that. The wholeness of that. And we're just saying, you don't have to wait until you make that transition in order to feel that way. You can release yourself into that thought by thought by choosing how you feel as the dominant point of focus. We know you understand. Let's see another video.